If you want a sense of what it looked like when Earl Douglas found the site over a century ago, you gotta come here to this rock wall. What's behind me is the Morrison Formation. This particular rock unit is what makes Dinosaur National Monument so famous. This is a rock unit that preserves floodplains, rivers, these ancient environments that were covered in ferns and conifer forests and dominated by some of the most famous dinosaurs that you're likely to see in a museum. So if you want to find a dinosaur, you need to know where to look. So where do you find dinosaurs? Well, there's a couple different kinds of rocks in the world. There's igneous rocks, like the kind of stuff that comes out of volcanoes. There's metamorphic rocks, which are changing states. But really, you're looking for sedimentary rocks, and they are exactly what they sound like. It's rocks that's ancient sediment. So right next to me here is a distal caudal vertebrae. So that's one of the end of the tail vertebrae from a dinosaur. And the little bone chips and pieces all throughout here. So this is the sort of thing that we're looking for, a kind of rock that represents an ancient environment where sediment was being laid down and burying dinosaurs. If you want to make a fossil record, that's what you need. You need something for burial.